Daniel Coleman and I was bullied. When I asked the teacher for help and I was turned away, I felt like there was no way to make the bullying stop. However, I found a way. Together with my principal and school counselor, they worked with me to make the bullying stop. Ryan is sitting in class and working on his assignment when another student walks up to his desk and tries to write on his work. He puts his arms and hands around his work and tries to protect it from the other student. The other student then shoves his work onto the floor. Ryan stands up and kneels down in order to get his things. The other student then sits down and waits at a nearby desk. The teacher looks up and warns Ryan who is kneeling on the floor to pick up the materials and to get back to his desk. Ryan tries to explain that it is not his fault and the teacher just brushes them away, waving their hand in the air in a dismissive way, and the other student who caused the problem is sitting nearby laughing. Students are in the locker room at the end of gym class. They're gathering their books in their bags and there is a lot of talking and playing going on. Off to the side there is a student and he is not really participating with the other students. He's just getting his stuff together when about three students come up to him and demand his books, his phone, and his money. He tells them no and asks them to leave him alone. However, they shove him a little and demand his things again. He looks around to see if there's a teacher, but to his dismay, there wasn't. No one is trying to help him in any way. Students are in the hallway walking to their classes. There is a student and we will call him A, like the others, is walking with a friend from one classroom to another. They are approached by a couple of kids who are walking towards them, we will call those B and C. B knocks into A, making A drop all of his books. The books then hit the floor and scatter with loose papers all around them. A and his friend bend down to pick them up. B and C kick the papers and books, making it difficult for A and his friend to pick them up. The other kids are now gathering around to watch. A teacher comes out and says what's going on and tells student A and his friend to move it and that they need to get to class. Student B and C laugh as they move away down the hallway. What should you do if you are being bullied? Don't be afraid to let someone know if you are being bullied. Tell an adult or someone you can trust like your guidance counselor, your principal, or your parents. What can you do if you witness bullying? When witnessing bullying, you should try three things. Find an adult, attempt to stop the bully, or support the person being bullied. I am an IB student now at Central High School and am applying to Ivy League schools. I started a bullying awareness campaign to help other students just like me, just like you. Because I found my voice and I use it to help others who are being bullied, I was recognized by the governor's office and awarded the governor's citation. There is help for you. There is hope.